This is a 28-year-old male with long-standing history of seizures localizing to the inframedial right temporal lobe on EEG. The images demonstrate a small hippocampus on the right with increased T2 flare signal intensity and a somewhat disorganized anatomic configuration of the cortical gray matter and some cortical white matter. In addition, the fornix is noted to be small on the right as compared to the left, and the right mammillary body is hypoplastic as compared to the left. There is slight dilatation of the right temporal horn as compared to the left. These imaging findings are compatible with mesial temporal sclerosis on the right. Mesial temporal sclerosis is the most common association with intractable temporal lobe epilepsy. Most patients present with complex partial temporal lobe seizures. Association with infantile febrile seizures is controversial. Particular areas of the hippocampus affected include the dentate gyrus, CA1, CA4, and CA3 areas. On histologic sectioning, there is neuronal cell loss, gliosis, and sclerosis. Typical MR imaging features include atrophy of the epsilateral fornix and mammillary body, increased signal intensity and atrophy of the anterior thalamic nuclei, atrophy of the cingulate gyrus, reduction in volume of the amygdala, and reduction in volume of the subiculum, along with many other imaging features. Treatment is with primary anti-epileptic agents, but in those who are refractory to medical management, temporal lobectomy or selective amygdalohippocampectomy may be performed.